do you really need own home to live it's a thought provoking question so if you got any question with respect to that you can post in the comment section right so hi hello this is ganesh and your melina coach and author of the book money leaks and upcoming author of the book one page stock market plan and uh, please subscribe to this channel so that you get such thought provoking questions as well as videos on mutual funds stock market and everything to create unlimited wealth thank you so let's go go and so do you really need uh, your own home to live so just think about that it's very simple if you're an aspiring aspiring uh, in uh, home buyer or if you're aspiring to have a own home or if your only goal in life is to have own home and people will say that i need a own home and i need to sit in that that is more than enough even if it is a small home no, with no facilities let's go and sit in that all right so if you are that kind of person you should watch this video you should share this video with your friends because uh, they may be suffering in the coming days or they may be already suffering right because i had seen people who had done this mistake and that is the reason i'm doing this video so i'm not against buying home or i'm not against uh, all the all that aspect because uh, i'm against buying home uh, pushing away all the other enjoyment and happiness in life and just living for the sake of uh, buying home i think people uh, just when they are starting to grow up they think that i can manage home instead of buying a, uh, instead of living in a rented home let me live in my home let me pay the emi in my for my home and after 20 years that is going to be me that is the thought process which is coming now but the point is after a few months they will see the loans and they say that the, what they the loan what they have uh, Uh, what they are uh, pay the loan amount is around uh, 40 50 lakhs and what they are paying is almost double the amount it may be 80 90 lakhs or even higher so why the hell i should pay the bank let me try to close it down and they'll do whatever it takes to close down the loans for the next couple of years and job security will come into picture and it's a very uh, pathetic situation i can say and very stressful situation to be in and if you look at all the aspect came into the very simple reason that it's a human emotion i just want to live in my own home my security if i live in my own own home who is going to question me i can do whatever i want just think of if you're living in a rented home who is going to ask you is the is the owner is going to come and is a house owner is going to come and ask you every time is this is my home is he going to come and tell that this is my home no even in rented home you are going to live a happy life even in your own home you are going to live a happy life in the same way treat your treat your rented home as an own home and live a happy life and once you are satisfied once you earn money once you are ready to buy that home with the money what you have then go for it why do you want to lose your happiness lose your uh, uh, enjoyment in life enjoy the uh, life with your kids when they are growing up instead of uh, getting the stress of paying the money right uh, it's all about human emotion if you just think for 5 days and considering the pros and cons together don't put uh, pros and cons put everything pros whatever comes to your mind uh, uh, um, after that human emotion is it really needed and cons what is that what will happen if you are buying that loan what might happen what might be the loan you need to pay after 10 years or 15 years and uh, just think of how your parents lived all the parents all the parents of uh, 60s 70s or 80s till 80s what they did is they just got a job and then they try to survive in the job they made sure they're living in the job for a very long time it it depends upon the economy as well what they lived is that so job itself was a very difficult thing because they came out of a um, freedom struggle and there was no job opportunity slowly government companies were opening up and they got into the job or they did business they struggled hard and after 50 or 60s they got a home and it's a savings what they made in the last 20 years that was funding their own home and they are living they were living in that home for the next 20 30 years or they just bought home and they are living right now but what we people are doing is that uh, we are having lots of money because we studied hard we we got a new good job we completed engineering or professional degrees or doctors or whatever and after that we for status symbol we wanted home and we even if there is a own home we want to get into that trap we want to get into that trap and finally we are living happiness for saying that that loan i should close away for the next 5 years let me put it uh, close everything forgetting about that your retirement is in your hand forgetting that your happiness is in your hand right so you are losing all that aspect and then just for the sake of the closed building you're losing everything again don't lose your emotions for 5 days just think of if you are buying a home what will happen if you are not buying right now what will happen i am just asking you to postpone for few more months years and plan for it whether is it possible to plan for it have a 50 to 60% money 
get 30 to 40 percent loan and buy that right now most of the people are just applying with 20 to 30 percent uh, investments and they want to get into buying a home so that is that is when i'm against it so please enjoy your life life is to enjoy and with some commitments that commitment will come if you make the commitment that let me invest for my home that is also a commitment right paying emi is not a commitment it's a foolish thing the foolish statement what your parents and so many people had told that if you need a commitment pay for it pay for the sip pay for investing in stock market and learn and do that that is a commitment once you make your money to grow then what will you going to do with so much money then buy the home that is the point so if you like this video please click the subscriber button and share this video with your friends thank you so much for watching